Hi, this is Zach from White Smoke Software. Today we're going to talk about comparison of adjectives. Okay, three things I want to mention to you before we continue. First of all, first of all we're going to talk about the word as in comparisons, equal and not equal, and I'm also going to teach you how to use a little bit of easy, easy mathematics. Because like any um, language, languages are mathematics. We build in our minds how to create and build sentences and whatever, but we do it mathematically. So I'm going to show, I'm going to show you a little bit of that also. Let's start with comparisons of adjectives, equal and not equal. Equal is a positive, like in mathematics, one plus one equals two, it's a positive. One minus one equals zero, it's a negative. And how do we know in English we have a negative? We use the word not, no, those are your negatives. So we've got equal and we've got not equal. We've got as. And I've talked about math. Something plus something will equal something. So let's begin. This is part one of comparisons of adjectives. Okay, if I want to compare two things by using the word as, let's take the mathematics that I just taught you. Let's go ahead and take as plus adjective plus as equals the rest of the sentence. For example, the Grand Hotel is as good as the Plaza Hotel. Okay, so what do we have here? We have the Grand Hotel is as good, there's your as plus your adjective, as the, again, adjective, uh, as after that adjective. As plus adjective plus as. Okay, and there's a prime example in the um, positive. Positive meaning equal. Now, something that's not equal, let's talk about that. So we're using the negative not, okay? My grades are not as high as your grades, okay? There's where something is not equal. And we go ahead and we compare that way. Thanks.